connectivity has uh, proven that it's more and more important as time goes by, particularly with what we've been through over the past couple of years. We are really reliant on connectivity uh, in the home place as well as the workplace. And we see uh, on day-to-day -day basis people um, always asking the question when they're coming to view a property, how is the Wi-Fi? And you have children on one side, whether they're sort of streaming, and then you have parents on the desktop trying to work. You know, the whole household has to work in synchronicity with one another. Um, the prospect of, of fibre connectivity in, uh, in Guernsey is hugely important. I also think it's really important when people are moving into the island. Um, so what we have seen is the demographic um, of people moving to the island lowering. Um, so particularly on the open market, um, where we actually have families and people coming to the island to work. Whether the headquarters are based in a European city or in the UK, um, they don't necessarily have to be based in Guernsey. And if they can have the support and the reliable networks, then it makes it all the more attractive. Um, if those networks are not in place, they simply will choose another jurisdiction. And for that reason, um, reliable, quality fibre technology would be a huge advancement for Guernsey. Joys is an audiovisual production company and we've been based in Guernsey for the past 37 years. We get involved in a huge range of events. What we are now seeing is a demand for these events to be live streamed, whether it be a funeral or a wedding that guests cannot come over for or attendees of a conference. High speed internet connections are absolutely vital when it comes to live streamed events to allow those watching from home or the workplace to feel like they're actually there in the room as the event is taking place. The introduction of Fibre in the Home for Guernsey would be an absolutely fantastic initiative, not only for us to allow us to upload at real time speed, but also for those watching from home and they can do so uninterrupted. As a teacher we're trying to work smarter, we're trying to introduce more technology into our courses and a lot of resources and a lot of infrastructure is going online. The issue is getting that content up onto the internet services such as YouTube is quite time consuming. Fiverr will just turn that around and that will mean that there will be less time uploading and more time creating which can only be a good thing. You've got improved bandwidth so more people can use it at once and it enhances the overall learning experience. I play a rally game called WRC. At the end of a season, the best players in the world, they get a fully paid trip to go to an official rally. I've qualified for the finals three times. The internet speed sort of comes down to the multiplayer aspect side of things. You need to have a stable internet connection to keep the cars solid to the track. Fibre to Home greatly reduces um, server latency, um, which is basically the time which it takes from something you do on your side to get to the server. I used to do some part-time streaming, um, but since I've moved to Guernsey, the connection isn't stable enough for me to do that. Fibre to the Home would mean I could pick up streaming again um, and start rebuilding the fan base that I used to have. Gaming in general is growing in popularity worldwide. If Guernsey were to get fibre to the home, it would boost its external reputation and hopefully it will get other people into gaming around Guernsey as well.